April 12th, St. Julius I, Pope. The Martyrology says that Pope St. Julius I fought for the Catholic faith against the Arians. He acquired the fame of sanctity and rested in peace after many glorious interventions in the Arian controversies. He was the son of a Roman citizen named Rusticus and succeeded Pope St. Mark in the year 337. Julius I fought against the Eusebians who continued the Arian heresy and had a violent hatred for St. Athanasius, Bishop of Alexandria. When Athanasius tried to retake his see of Alexandria, the heretics opposed him and appealed to the Pope who convened the Council of Sardica in the year 343. However, St. Athanasius's accusers did not attend. The case against St. Athanasius was, however, very carefully examined in their absence, and the letter which the Pope subsequently sent to the Eusebian bishops in the East has been characterized as one of the most finest monuments of ecclesiastical antiquity, and also as a model of weightiness, wisdom, and charity. Calmly and impartially, he meets their accusations one by one and refutes them, Towards the end, he states that the procedure they ought to have followed. Are you not aware that it is customary that we should first be written to, that from hence what is just may be defined, whereas you expect us to approve condemnations in which we had no part? This is not according to the precepts of Paul or the tradition of the fathers. All this is strange and new. Allow me to speak as I do. I write what I write in the common interest. And what I now signify is what we have received from the blessed apostle Peter. Thus, the council vindicated St. Athanasius and endorsed the statement previously made that any bishop deposed by a synod of his providence has a right to appeal to the bishop of Rome. Nevertheless, it was not until the year 346 that St. Athanasius was able to return to Alexandria. On his way, he passed by Rome, and St. Julius cordially received him and wrote a touching letter to the clergy and faithful of Alexandria, congratulating them on the return of their holy bishop. St. Julius built several churches in Rome, notably the Basilica of Julia, now the Church of the Twelve Apostles, and the Basilica of St. Valentine. St. Julius died on April 12th in the year 352.